What's up, guys? Mario Man Two Three here, and we've got a box from Romeoville. Look at that! This box is ready to ship. So they shipped this to me. So this is a set that I bought uh, during Double VIP, and this gave me gave me enough Double VIP points to for two hundred dollars, which is a set coming um, pretty soon. But story about this is I had two gift cards. I had one for $150. I had one for $100. And I tried to use them when I bought my Avengers Tower. But when I bought the Avengers Tower, um, I tried to use them and I was going to pay the difference out of my PayPal account because I had I had some sales in my Bricklink store and I had a little bit of money. Then I was just going to move, do that. And it wouldn't let me do PayPal with that. So I ended up paying for that. With my PayPal funds, I still got the gift cards. Thought I lost the gift cards. Luckily, I took a screenshot of them. So this was a $150 gift card. Um, and, which means that all I paid was very little bit of tax on this thing. And I've been waiting for this one since it came out. And I was waiting for a good gift with purchase. But before a gift with purchase came out that I wanted, they ran double the VIP. So... It was on back order, naturally, but that's okay. I went ahead and did it, got my double VIP points, and I just waited, and here it is. And this is from Romeoville, and th you can see this box is smushed a little bit. Although it held up really good, you can see the... So let's see what's inside. I like these boxes that are custom-made for these sets. I wonder if there's a bunch of different sizes or if uh, they make the Lego boxes to fit in these. Anyway, here it is. Box isn't in bad shape. Box survived. There it is, the Batmobile. The classic Batmobile. And I will be building this one. I've been wanting this one uh, since it was announced. And I will be displaying it. So the question is, is how am I going to display it? Well, up there, I've got, you can't see it now. I'll show you when I build it and put it on display. I've got my Ecto-1, I've got my DeLorean. And I'm going to have to move some stuff around. I am going to get it on display. I'm going to have to be creative. I might have to get me a couple more floating shelves. Um, but that's for another day. But I just wanted to do a quick little haul because it showed up and I'm very ecstatic really want to get started building this one. I'm actually working on a project right now. I'm uh, doing a little rearranging in the room. So we'll see how this turns out. I'll give you a, just a brief little room tour when I get it done. Might be a few weeks from now, but curiosity killed the cat. So you guys can be curious about what I'm doing and just wait for it because I have a reveal coming with a lot of stuff won't change, but there is a few little things that will be different. So until then, thanks for watching. Really appreciate all the support. I do have another set coming that will probably be here tomorrow. You'll probably see that before you see the room redo. I'm not doing nothing major where I'm moving all these cabinets around. I'm just talking about a little bit of display stuff might be different. And I actually went ahead and cleaned the closet out. and So I've got some stuff in there. So... We're in the process of just moving some stuff around. That's because that's what we do. That's what Joey says we like to do. We just we just like to move the deck chairs around on the Titanic. So that's all for this one, guys. Really appreciate all the support. And until the next one. <laughs>